And now, this next fight, three three-minute rounds in the SFL welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting at the red corner, a mixed martial artist standing at five feet, nine inches tall. He weighed in at 170 pounds and represents elite athletics and Aries BJJ. Here is Justin T. Ray Harrell. And his opponent standing across the cage, fighting into the blue corner. A mixed martial artist standing at six feet, two inches tall. He weighed in at 170 pounds and represents wartime MMA. Here is Darnell Gardner. And when the action begins, our referee in charge is Ted Lynn. Ladies and gentlemen, we are underway with this 170 pound welterweight fight. Oh, and my right God. away, he gets hit with the flying knee. Darnell Gardner on the pursuit now. Holy Lord, did you see that flying knee right out of the gate? It dropped him right off the jump, Eddie, and here he's not letting up anytime soon. Yeah, Harold's doing a great job of recovering, relying on his wrestling, going back to his base, going for that takedown. He did a great job of recovering. If he can get this takedown, Oh, a oh, beautiful he's, knee. He's looking for that wow. jumping knee. He's looking to end this fast. These knees of Gardner are no joke, but Harold's doing exactly what he's supposed to be doing. Holding his opponent against the fence, filling up his arms full of blood, well, we know We know Harold's got an excellent wrestling chops, but the thing is, can he get him to the ground now after being rocked like that? Yeah. Well, even if he doesn't right now, at least having this moment to recover is excellent for Harold here. He's looking to... Press his head away and get that knee in again. Yeah, Harold's doing a good job of blocking the thigh, not allowing the knee to come up. Travis, uh, Travis Brown elbows here from Gardner. We were not wasted any time. We're low on action with this one, Eddie. Yeah, something in the air tonight. Something oh, in the air. A beautiful job by Justin to the Harrell. Ground. But pop, Gardner right back up. Pops right back up out of that, as you say it, Eddie. Good job of uh, getting that separation from Harold. And woo, can we get some breathing room now? <laughs> I know. Oh, man. I've been nervous all night. Like, just looking at the lineup has me anxious. Harold looking a little more timid after getting that hit with that flying knee there. Yeah, but he he's definitely looks recovered. That was a huge flying knee he ate. Yeah, that'll wake you up for the night. Yeah. Oh. Oh, see, Garner doesn't want to go back to the well too many times because, like you were saying, the wrestling chops of Harold are, are really phenomenal. And it seems like Garner really wants to strike, so being here I don't think is, uh, was part of the oh, plan. Oh, and wow. the takedown by Harold. Now we're, he's getting his world. Let's see what Gardner can do off his back, see if he's got any subs or submission attempts, or if he just maybe looks to tie up and look for a referee stand-up. Now we know this is going to be a bad position here for Gardner. Harold being an excellent wrestler. They're looking to work his game here now. Yeah, and uh, yeah, Harold's been training with Team Abu, so. Oh, look out for that triangle. See, Harold wants to keep his arm on the right side. He does not want to let Gardner get that arm across. Oh, oh and I can't see. He might switch to the arm here. We'll get a nice view of the rear here. Excellent sweep. Mm. Bad position for Harold. Ten seconds left, though, so he could hold on here. Excellent job by Justin Harold to get side control. Ladies and gentlemen, what a fight. Wow.
And here we go with round two. The action does not stop here. Yeah, don't blink anyone. Oh, Harold, excellent job using his punches before he tries to get the takedown. And he has his hands to clasp. He's going to get the takedown. Oh, nice takedown by Harold. Oh, wow. He looks ferocious now. Yeah, he yeah, seems to be fully recovered and, and ready to do some damage. We got Brad Morris and Professor Daniel in his corner. Some Aries BJJ guys. Now we get to see what Harold's going to work with from here, whether he's going to go for the ground and pound or he's going to go work a submission. So far, he hasn't been able to do too much with the, the groundwork, but, you know, it's real early in round two. Yeah, he's not doing much uh, in terms of offense, but what he is doing is keeping Gardner defensive and keeping him off of his back where he's not quite as dangerous, or at least hasn't been thus far. Well, what he is doing right oh, now wow. here is stacking up points. Gotta watch those, those beautiful gotta, elbows. you got to watch the 12-6, to 6, though. Those were clean, um, but they were they were really close. For some reason, you're not allowed to bring oh, the elbow. Oh, looks to step up over, but it gets reversed in the process. Excellent well, job of Harold staying with it. And there's those wrestling chops paying dividends. Yeah. But, hey, Gardner definitely, we know he has submissions off his back. He has sweeps. You're looking to go for that sweep again. Referee warning him to stay busy here. Yeah. Yeah, Gardner's doing a good job of tying up, but Harold, he's he's working stuff. See, this is dangerous to go for in the guard because the guy on the bottom can easily throw up an armbar from here. Ooh, oh, looks no like way. he's going for a submission. He here. might be passing. That thing is in deep. Americana. Amer oh, and he passes with it into full mount. Oh, oh my goodness, ladies and gentlemen, this might get nasty. Oh. Justin Harrow has landed punches oh, wow. here right in front of us. Wow, big blows. Oh, he's got him flattened out now. He might be able to posture up and just rain down punches and stop this. Terrible position for Darnell Gardner. Justin Harrell is a monster on top. You do not want him throwing down punches on you. Oh, he's got the neck. He's got the neck. He's in deep. That's he's a tap. tap. Ladies and gentlemen, Justin Harrell with the submission victory. What a comeback. Wow. A much needed victory there for Justin Harrell. Beautiful submission victory. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ted Lynn has called a stop to the action at 2 minutes, 27 seconds of the second round. Declaring the winner by submission due to a rear naked choke, Justin T. Ray.